Well, morning everybody. Monday, 5th of December, and uh, I've got, I'm back on the field where I was last, and I've got the cones out to um, try and cover properly all this area. Um, first signal is this item it looks like a, a leather mount there's no lettering on it or anything like that no decoration so it's plain and oval shaped two retaining pins I thought it was a brooch at first I mean it could still be but uh, no I would say it's a, a leather uh, mount right on to the next okay had about an hour uh, on this bit doing those lines there you can see um, just had a Victoria penny here so I thought while well, I've stopped I shall do a quick round up because uh, I will be moving the corns further on that's interesting it's probably nothing but uh, oh well wow I never thought it's really light <laughs> but I thought is that silver or something on it uh, I think it's aluminium yeah yeah I don't know what that is really a uh, bullet, that uh, brass plate, what looks like the remains of a tarpaulin ring, strange looking button, not cleaned them off, I mean, they're only buttons really, <laughs> tap handle from a barrel tap maybe, Um come back button part of a lock mechanism I thought it was just the key surround but it's inside of it you know and a modern penny four hole button and I'm just getting that from that all there Victoria can't see the date on it it's uh, a little bit mangled should we say worse for wear <laughs> okay we'll move on okay nice uh, 14 signal there I don't mind finding these especially when uh, they're decorated nice little clog clip clasp clip whatever can't really make out what the decoration is but uh, yeah better than the plain ones moving on okay from that hole there not too deep we have a nice uh, decorative piece of um, copper alloy Uh, that seems to have some age to it. It's blank on the other side. I mean, I would say maybe it's a spoon stem. Something like that. Could be wrong. But yeah, that's nice that. Nice decoration. If I, I'll turn it the other way, because I think that's a flower. Yeah. Lovely. Moving on. Okay. 
just had a right carry on there trying to find a 10 signal and it turns out it is a lead chicken so yeah it was there just couldn't pinpoint it but uh, field must be really mineralized because pinpoint is going off all the time I've got a resort to me coil to uh, to find items still that's the way the cookie is lovely that very nice little chicken Surprise it hasn't been snapped up by KFC. <laughs> Moving on. Well, what a nightmare I'm having. I got this. Eventually. Now. That, to me. <laughs> I mean, it came up with 17 signal on the Nox so it's got to be copper it's got to be part of a copper jacket and then I turned it over and there's uh, all that on that side I mean I, I just don't know I don't think it's anything really but uh, yeah Hell of a time looking for it amongst that lot. God almighty, me pinpointer wouldn't point it out. Pulling me hair out, I was. Right, let's get cracking, we'll carry on. I'll give it another hour. Okie doke. We have here a 16 signal. And it looks like that's some sort of uh, a hanger of some kind <coughs> it's decorated seems to be a little spot here which I'll give uh, a good looking at and we'll carry on right there's a lot of signals around here and uh, they're not very deep so we have this other um, little clog clip and it has uh, some writing on it as well as a, a fox I think tile tag or something tie tag I'm not sure I'll give it a good clean up later and uh, but yeah great when they come out and they've got uh, some decoration on or picture or something Okay, let's see what else comes up. Okay. <laughs> Last signal. Literally. On my way to the gate. And I seem to have pulled out a silver here. Of, um, who? I don't know. That looks like an Anne, actually. Looking at that profile now. <laughs> oh, yes. There's never any detail left on them though. I shall give that a clean up when I get back. It's uh, the light's rapidly fading now. Oh boy, I love this field, tell ya. There's more to be found on here. The signals I've had. Anyway, I shall make me way. Shall make me way back. And uh don't know what that was eh? Make me way back and we'll see you tomorrow on the next hunt. Yeah that looks like and to me. Woohoo <laughs> Only the second one of them I've got. By the light of the silvery moon. Anyway, just 
just had a signal there on my way back and uh, we have this item yeah, it looks like a holder of s some kind I don't think it's too old anyway let's on to the next <coughs> Morning everybody, back on the, uh, the site that's given us so much um, It's Tuesday, 6th of December and uh, not bad for a first haul I'll just turn the camera around It's another one of these uh, metal clasps a big thanks to uh, Bill and uh, God, I've forgotten your name now for the ID on this Julie, Bill and Julie um, yeah so either a, a buckle a clamp or a metal holder but unfortunately it's uh, it was cracked and it's broke off as I was taking it out the hole but them's the brakes right let's carry on okay curious bit of lead here I don't know if it's uh, the remains of a farm token or just I mean the longer you look at lead the, the more you see in it <laughs> it's a strange thing but it'll go in the finds box it was a nice uh, 14 15 signal right uh, he's one other detectorists might have uh, just ignored One really old hand forged nail. However, if you look at the thickness that it would have covered, it's possible that could have gone through a shield, a wooden shield, and it's uh, cor the wood's obviously corroded over time, and so is the iron. But that's a possibility. Yeah, I like that. I mean, I don't know why people just aren't interested in iron, but uh, I find it it's fascinating because of its possibilities, what it used to do, not for the present, what it used to do. But I might be in a minority. Let's move on. Right, another iron item. figure of it uh, loop and twisted into locking rings yeah very old uh, old age work hand forged hand hammered nice moving on okay from that hole there which isn't far from the fence 
made it really difficult to detect but the knocks come through and we have one hammered what looks like a half groat or a groat but who do not know let's find some sun see if we can uh, get some better light on it That's the uh, that's the obverse, and the reverse has got a shield on it. So, as for who that is, it was it was really dirty. I'll have to um, get some bicarb on it and uh, give it a gentle rub. See if we can get some more detail off it, but woohoo, get in there. Yeah, um, just as an addition, Monday evening, last night, I, um, as I was watching certain YouTube channels, I, um, came across this guy who'd uh, just recently updated his 800 so I thought oh there must be an update out so I went on to try and update this and uh, turns out I already had version 3 so as I'm looking at me uh... anyway long story short I, um, I downloaded version 2 and uploaded it onto the machine because I just find version 3 is a little bit uh, just a little bit it's okay it's it's okay but uh, for some reason version 2 seems to uh, I don't know I've had more success with it it could just be me but uh, yeah he certainly picked this one out anyway. Right, <laughs> that said, we shall move on. Yeah, so it was an accidental download of um, version 2. Because of the download that I had on my computer. But, hey ho, such is life. I'll get version 3 back on at some point. Because I was doing okay with it. Right. Moving on. Okay. From yonder hall. We have either a utility ring or bridle ring. It could actually be a finger ring. It's uh, flat on the inside. Uh, it's got markings around it. Could be an annular brooch. Yeah really old that okay let's move on right I've not recorded anything for a while because I've just been uh, <coughs> digging up rubbish but I have a very interesting small piece of lead here has a, a little, for want of a better word, a nipple on the top. Could it be a gaming piece? Uh, just dots and things on the, uh, on the reverse there. Yes, um, interesting. 
love stuff like that so it's lead but um what could it be hmm very interesting found next to some uh, how can I put it just some old limestone pavement that'll do it because uh, yeah okay we'll move on see what else I can get before the Sun goes down Whew, right nice sweet uh, 22 signal here and it's uh, that's just come out and a nice piece of bronze before so this is an old area Ooh. oh well, that's weighty weighty matey right give this a brush off and then get back to you the sun's setting it won't be long before I go let's get it cleaned off well I like brushing I always do well I just thought I'd capture that sunset right cleaned off that bronze ring yes I'm hoping there's more here only because they were really deep uh, I think other detectors have missed them right making use of the available light let's get on <laughs> 